We're gamers united, where we're gonna play games. You know we're gonna have fun. Plus, we share our game play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gamers United. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the final episode of Metroid Dread. Uh, you can see I got all the max uh, missiles, max power bombs, max life. Um, to close it out here, I got you know 100%, 100%, 100%, 100%. Pretty much, it's just going around all the places and like looking for the blinky spots or just checking every nook and cranny. Um, I was gonna show it in a separate video, but some of them just got really, really frustrating. Like they're really hard. Like you had to like uh, do this thing called a shine spark, where uh, you do the chart, you do the run charge, so our speed boost, and um, it uh, then you have to hold it, uh, do the uh, down thing, where like you you have it for like five seconds, and then you have to use it on specific blocks but like some of them you actually have to hold it for quite a while then get to a certain area and then use it or the one I just last did was in Varinia it was this one down here pretty much you had to run across this get the speed boost go down here shoot down here do the speed boost and you go and then you run continue to run slide under here you then you charge another one and you run up here and then you use a speed boost right here and then you get the missile pack really tricky stuff but um i got it all i i thought there was going to be like a special ending if i got them all that's why i was doing this this is on my second save file not my first save file the one i've been playing on um but um pretty much i thought it was like if you get 100 percent you get a different ending but pretty much you have to do it in a certain time limit to get different endings and or not different endings you get different ending rewards you get the same ending so that's all I was trying to get is a special ending for you guys but uh, without further ado let's go to the final boss um, I, this is actually the only boss I actually had a look up a playthrough to beat him I got to the second phase but the second phase I could never I couldn't figure out until they uh, they showed me I forget which video it was but they didn't know in the third phase you can use a power bomb to get some life which is really useful and I was able to do this with I think about half this life so let's uh, let's get into the final boss and uh, I'll still probably die a couple times don't worry you know me I've uh, played some of these bosses in advance and I did I think I understand them and I still die in the in the video but, um... Stay tuned to this stuff right here. Uploading data. It appears your Metroid DNA has caused you to become a Metroid. Ordinarily, this would have happened immediately after the DNA transplant. Your Fofa genes must have slowed down the process. They were the only tribe capable of controlling the Metroids. Though you possess their DNA, you are not a Fofa. Your physical prowess suggests that you must also possess Machin DNA. Metroids are programmed to identify Machin as enemies. This suggests one thing to me. It is very probable that your metamorphosis occurred as a result of Raven Beak's attack. His presence awakened the Metroid's killer instinct. Since then, your metamorphosis has accelerated. It can no longer be controlled. You are now a Metroid, Samus Aran. Your very existence poses a grave threat to the galaxy. However, there is no need to fear. You can still contribute to galactic peace. You need only use your new powers correctly. Making sure our, our cat isn't going behind the TV with all the wires. You have followed my instructions faithfully so far. Continue to do so. It's that simple. I consider your performance here on ZDR highly satisfactory. As I hope, it has even awakened your Metroid powers. I was right to let you live during our first encounter. That one glimpse you showed told me everything. Submit and offer up your power. My plan is the only way to bring order to the galaxy. Fulfill your destiny, Samus. This is an order. 
disobedience will not be tolerated. Taking orders now? What? Ah. Oh. 
bullets there. Really? Again. Good with you. Okay, that was a horrible first fight. Okay. That was a horrible first fight. Alright. Last time I bought, fought him, I did so perfectly, and that, that time I just fought him, it was just... That other fight never happened. buttons there. You actually have to use the right sword. You can't just stand there. And I am doing so much better. So. That's right, buddy. You're gonna have to bring it now. Oh, yeah, orange. I have to admit, I was doing better at this than I was. And I usually am. Usually at this one time. Ah! Uh. I thought he was doing the blast or something. 
yeah. <laughs> this took me a little while to first time I played this. Back to the human Samus, I think. There we go, let's get out. Where's the ship? Where's the ship? Show the ship fly right through it. There it is. So that was Metroid Dread. Pretty awesome game, um, definitely good with all the Metroid games, um, I'd say probably, um, I'd say Super Metroid might still be my favorite, but Metroid Dread is high up there. There's some challenging bosses, um, Metroid Fusion is another good one, uh, Metroid Prime, I wasn't too much a fan of, only because it was kind of hard to play, I mean, the Metroid Prime games that seemed like they had that final last boss that I could not beat. And uh, I would use a cheat code to get an infinite health to beat the final boss and then the game messed up so I wouldn't be able to see the ending. So it's kind of been a cramp in my heart. <laughs> but uh, I mean, they're pretty good games. I mean, they do a good job. Um, we're going to skip through all this. Uh, credits because everyone's probably seen the credits we're gonna see what our final result is oh yeah you, you can play on hard mode after you play this because it's so that you're technically you're actually in normal mode 12 hours and 29 minutes and 10 seconds There's my 100%. Uh, let's see what else uh, extras we got here. 
fresh got the keys. Had, um, beat the game in four hours, two hours, and hard mode, and all this stuff to beat to get this. Man, that's cool. Oh, that was good. oh that's Mother Brain, that's Craid, Raven Peak now. Uh, that dude over there, I guess, M. Bison's in this game. I don't remember him in this game. <laughs> Metroid. Oh, there's Ridley. Okay, I didn't see Ridley for a second. Um, there's the Emmys, that nice guy. Um, I wonder if there's any like other callback. No. So I was hoping there was like the alien boss or the fish boss. But then again, they could have been like those could be those bosses. I don't know. All oh, those chosen warriors. Mission log. Look at all that stuff. But uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, definitely check this game out. It is awesome. Yeah, my other one, I only have 46%. I don't have any. Oh, wait. Oh, here we go. Let's see that. I only got this one. Uh, pretty much it's just the different Metroids. Picture the different Metroids games. There's like Super Metroid, uh, uh, what other ones are there? Um, Fusion, um, Metroid Samus Returns. I guess this would be, maybe, I think it's just all the Metroids. Like there's Metroid Zero, Metroid One, Metroid Two, Super Metroid Three. Um, But, uh, yeah, definitely check this game out. It's pretty fun. Um, but until uh, next video, thank you so much for watching. Um, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content. No pressure. Um, comment if you want to talk video games. Uh, particularly probably the one that we're playing. But, you know, I'm an open, open book on video games. So uh, you can feel free to talk about any of the games I played here. Or any games in general. I'd love to... Like to, like to talk video games. Um, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> I said that a million times, but one more. <laughs> uh, have a wonderful day. Game on and take care. Bye, guys. Hi, everyone. Thank you so much for watching this video. Both me and Chelsea greatly appreciate it. Um, if you want to subscribe to this channel, see more content, that's cool. If not, that's cool as well. Um, I'm a gamer who likes to play games, talk games, love games, breathe games. All that fun jazz. But uh, everyone out there, have a wonderful night. Take care. And game on, gamers. Bye. Bye.